40 years. The Denver International Film Festival is becoming downright venerable. In the 1970s, there were very few film festivals in the U.S. when a New Yorker named Ron Henderson transplanted to Denver and he missed seeing foreign and independent films. He and a group of co-founders managed to sell the idea to a major sponsor, pulled off the first festival in 1977, and persisted through ups and downs to become what they are today. At the gala marking the 40th anniversary, Denver Film Society members did some reminiscing about the festival, which has gained a national reputation as it has launched films and boosted careers. Each year brings an eclectic mix of international and independent works and sometimes the first look at a big studio release like La La Land in 2016. It has been an amazing ride, says Ron Henderson. A lot of the great memories had to do with the guests who were here. The, and I remember in uh, our 1984, which was year seven of the festival, we downsized from 10 days to five days. In five days, we had as our guest Bill Murray, Steve Martin, Jonathan Demme, the Coen brothers, Eric Roberts, who is Julia Roberts' brother, Sandy Dennis. It was like the star power was blinding almost. First John Cassavetes Award, which we created in collaboration with John's widow, Jenna Rowlands, went to uh, Steven Soderbergh, who had just finished Sex, Lies, and Videotape which totally transformed independent film in, in this country. An important turning point for the festival was when philanthropist John C. became a major supporter, along with Stars Encore, giving the festival the stability of place, first at the AMC Tivoli Theatres, now at the C Film Center, where there is a year-round schedule of programs and education. Henderson says the Denver Film Festival is maintaining its relevance in a world where the audience has many choices in how they find and view films. Most of the people who utilize those are young people. One of our challenges is to build our, uh, our young audience. I'm hoping that, I know that film lovers like to watch films the way they were originally intended, which is in the dark with an audience. And we believe that the uh, C Film Center is the sanctuary for that experience. <laughs>